Okay, good morning you guys. I am so sorry that I have not been uploading videos a lot. We are just now getting our internet like the Wi-Fi guy is here right now. Um, so hopefully I will have already posted a video by the time this one goes live, but I just wanted to say that because I've just been doing a terrible job and y'all have been asking a lot for videos of the house. So I'm gonna be honest, right now I'm really struggling with um, kind of what I struggled with whenever I first moved into our apartment and I don't know that I ever really shared this on the vlog I don't remember but um, Kind of just like it not feeling like home yet. Everything is like chaotic um, <laughs> Like I'm there are things that can't be put away yet because I don't have what I need like I need a dresser So I can put all of my clothes away before I can even start on my room um I need my washer and dryer to get in so that I can organize the laundry room, which thankfully that will be in today. But there's so much that goes into the laundry room that's just kind of like laying on the floor right now. And usually I'm like a things need to be put away kind of person in order for me to feel sane. The kitchen, I'm trying to figure out how to make a small kitchen work for me. Um, and don't get me wrong guys, I'm not complaining. I'm so thankful for this house. I'm just trying to figure out how to make it work for me and my family long term and figuring out what we still need and stuff like that because this is a brand new house. There are things we need, like little things, like things to hang towels on, um, wallpaper, not wallpaper, um, toilet paper roll hangers, um, what else? Little knobbies to pull the cabinets open. Like, oh my gosh, I did not realize how important those were. Like, it's so hard to pull the doors open whenever your hands are wet and you need a towel or whatever. Um, so anyway, I'm not complaining. I'm just adjusting. And I would like to think I'm good at adjusting, but I'm not always. What's up, baby? Yes. But anyway, back to the kitchen. I'm trying to figure out how to make it work for me the best. Um, I'm gonna go in there and I'm gonna show y'all a little bit of what I got already. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, so let me just show you. This is the kitchen. I know once we have a dining room table, not a lot of stuff will go on the counters, but we're waiting for our table to come. Um, so this is our counter space. I like having the coffee stuff on the counter, but I'm just realizing like this is where I need the plates to go whenever I'm cooking dinner. Um, so I'm going to try and make this some sort of coffee cart, at least for now until I can get like a nice coffee bar. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I'm just trying to figure it out. We'll see. I have like a good amount of cabinet space, um, and like deep, what is it called? Deep drawers. Like that's where our plates go, which is awesome. So I'm just trying to figure out how to organize the best I can, I guess. This is the pantry. So naturally I wanted to use like these baskets to organize my stuff, but I'm just realizing like it's too much of a hassle to try and take out the top basket and pull it out and get it back in without everything clinking around. So um, just gonna get one of those things that goes right here and we'll see how we can get that to work. And like these appliances down here, like my Instant Pot, my Crock Pot and my Popcorn Maker, we use those all the time. Um, so I don't want to put them somewhere that's hard to get them so they're just going right there and I also don't want to put them up there because I think appliances on the cabinets look tacky. So I'm just doing my best working with what I got trying to figure it out because I do love this house. I love this kitchen. I love that it's small. Um, it will keep things simple. I'm just trying to figure out how to make that work for me the best that it can. So I don't know. I guess we'll see. But anyway, thanks so much for coming back to hang out with us today. I didn't say that. Uh, but yeah, welcome to the vlog. Okay, but first, really quick, look at how cool my blinds are. I just have to do this, and they lift up. Oops, shouldn't have done that sideways. Uh-oh, I messed it up. Oh gosh, I got it stuck, okay. All right, I'm already thinking that this is super ugly. Maybe Jack will be able to figure it out when he gets home because he's really good at that kind of stuff. But for now, I'm just gonna see if I can make it work in this cabinet, maybe. All 
right, I laid out four plates to see if it's something that we could make work right here, and I think it does, but let me show y'all how annoying this is. I was cooking chicken last night and stuff splattered all over the wall, so that sucks, but we're gonna get some backsplash back here eventually. And over on that side, also, I don't know what to do with this space, so if you can give me an idea, please do. I was thinking maybe some floating shelves with like some herbs or something, but there's like no light right there. I don't know, so. All right, we are finally members of the free world again because we have internet. Mia, you look really cool. I have no idea. And hopefully not much longer until my washer and dryer get here. I am so excited to have my own washer and dryer. Like, I mean, we've always had them in apartments. Most of the time we've had them in apartments, but I'm really excited that we own our own washer and dryer now. And it's actually like a pretty nice set. Like I didn't go spend like $4,000 cause there were sets that were like, Four and five thousand dollars, which is insane. I got like pretty basic ones, but I had originally ordered one set and realized it was too big, so I had to go in and cancel my order and order another set. And I like the set that I had to order better because it looks nicer. So I'm really excited for them to get here today. They should be here between four and six, and right now it's eleven. No, they should be here between twelve and six, and right now it's eleven. So hopefully only one more hour. I'm gonna try and do something with the upstairs. I've just been I've been trying to unpack the downstairs and just put things that I know belong upstairs. I've just been setting it on the stairs so I need to bring all of that up and then try and put it away a little more just so that things can be a little more in order because it's just a lot. So that's on the train. everything in the office and then I'm kind of just gonna divvy it out through here the first thing I'm gonna try and do is get this oh somebody's calling me organized a breast pump which hopefully I won't be having to use anytime soon that can go up here way back in that corner Okay, so I'm pretty much done for now, so I'm gonna show you how I have it set up. So down here, I have just a container of kid bask or kid blankets, a tripod I don't use that often, some backpacks we use whenever we go on trips. The two shelves above it are blank, so they're like at kid height. I'm gonna put some towels here. Towels, we need way more people towels. We need lots more washcloths and lots more lots more hand towels. So I think all of the extra linens will be stored up here because for now that's our only linen closet then over here jack's parents actually just gave us these white pottery barn sheets so i'm super excited about those then in here i have extra washcloths i love 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 these white washcloths so much um candle making stuff because i have nowhere else to put it and then this shelf is going to be games which i'm super excited about that we already have a collection of games we got some puzzles um kid games and then in here we have a bunch of adult card, not adult card games, but like grown up card games. Um, Regifting box, <laughs> baskets, which I don't know what to use for yet. Oh my gosh, that breast pump and then more baskets back there. Okay, so I was gonna wait on Jack to get home too. <laughs> oh my gosh, I seriously look like a man today. Sorry guys. Um, anyway, I was gonna wait until Jack gets home to put up the shower curtain in the girls' bathroom, but I'm gonna try and do it myself and hopefully don't mess it up. Extend to wall and twist 
until tight. Yeah, there you go. That's how you do the glue day. Then twist that. Yeah, then do that. Why are you doing it? Why are you doing it, Mommy? Now you have to see if it works. All right. All right, this clear curtain is what we're working with for right now until I get the other bath curtain that matches this set from Target, but I just don't wanna spend $20 on that right now. All right, I'm gonna take this stuff downstairs because my washer and dryer is gonna be here in about 10 minutes, so I'm gonna wash these. And I'm also just gonna try and get their bathroom set up a little bit. Okay, they're finally in and I'm super excited about them. This is how tall they are. I mean, I'm not like super tall, but they're like to my tummy. It's crazy. I think they're really big, but they're pretty big inside. Like, look at that. See, for size, pretty big. So yeah, anyway, I've never been so excited to do a load of laundry, but that's what I'm about to do. Oh, on. Ooh! Normal. Um, water level. Auto level, maybe? Um, cold. All right. Ha ha! All right, so I've been doing my best to try and get everything cleaned up and somewhat put away. I cannot lift that, that is way too heavy. Okay, so I'm like thinking the love sack's gonna go in this corner. I don't know if you remember, sorry, it's like getting dark. I don't know if you remember those three corner shelves that were in my bedroom, but those are going right there. Um, ugh, I really want a TV stand because this just looks like a frat house. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. This is what I've got so far out here. And then this is just so sweet. I have just been dying for so long to send the girls outside to play and stuff. Just to play in dirt and play in the grass. And now they are. You've got all that mud. There's a ton of mud down there. I don't think you can see. But it's just so nice. Mm. Tessa, look at me. Do you like your backyard? Yeah. Yeah. I want this to stay though. I want to put big desert. It'll probably be like that for a while. I'm not sure what their plan is to come and fix it. Hey. Hey, I tell I'm cleaning I'm cleaning the rooms that you have to clean up our room. That's so sweet of you. Let's see. Oh. Look at your corner, it's so nice. Y'all haven't really been on the vlog today. Can you say hi? Hi. Hey. Yes, the vlog muddy. All what? Let's close this window. Mia, do you like your room? Yeah. I got these little glasses from the dollar section at Target for them to have for their teeth brushing. Cute, perfect. But there's water in here. Yeah, there's water in here. Mm -hmm. Mom. What? Get your boots so you can come in our bedroom. Okay, hold on one second. I gotta figure out what I did with those plastic bags. I'm trying to keep all white plastic bags for our trash cans because we are not supposed to flush toilet paper. Since it's a septic system, that's what Jack said. All right, I got this, what is it, shower curtain from Target to make my bathroom a little less Dexter. And these to see, these were really cheap, they were like $4, but I wanted to see if we were responsible enough for um, white towels. And I got these. We're responsible enough, the girls are. 
Um, I'm not responsible enough. I wipe my makeup on towels. And then I got these nice shower rings because Jack didn't want the $3 plastic ones that I bought. <laughs> Alright, I like that. Hopefully Jack will like it too. He actually picked that out and then I went and bought it today.